I'll say this one thing that I would actually do because Aaron Hicks has the better arm with the changeup that Peralta possesses. If you're going to get a weak fly ball, it would be to right field. And Matt Carpenter in right field does not have a strong arm. Does Nimmo move off first base to eliminate any force or double play? They're giving him second base. Starling Marte. Another one of the off-season acquisitions for the Mets. You got it. You guys see where Carpenter is in right field. My question to you would be, why have him that deep? If the ball's hit that deep, runner's going to score. And he's taking a few steps in now. Ball one low. Lindor on deck if they get to him. Nimmo did not go to second on the pitch. Shut down the Yankees offense in that top half of the eighth inning after they tied it in the top half of the ninth, giving their offense a chance to win it. The offseason acquisitions have paid huge dividends in the Subway Series. Escobar leadoff double, big home run last night. Starling Marte, RBI single to win it. Max Scherzer, seven great innings tonight. Starling Marte, an electric player. And a jolt of electricity into this rivalry. A playoff atmosphere. And a difference maker type player coming up big in a big spot. Just seems like the two guys that yesterday wanted, the two new guys for the Mets that came in this year, Escobar Marte. Yep. They did it in the first inning last night. They close it out tonight. That's the 13th walk off in a regular season subway series game the Mets have now nine of those and for Starling Marte 11 career walk off hits most in baseball since the start of 2014.